Shot and injured just before 11 o'clock last night at her job at the CVS in downtown Louisville. Police say it's domestic related violence and she joins the more than one in three women in the United States that experience severe physical abuse in their lifetime. It is our top story here tonight at six. Hello, everybody. I'm Doug Prophet. Metro police say a total of two people were shot, then later sent to the hospital. The suspect was caught quickly by LMPD. It happened at the 4th and Ali CVS, a popular location surrounded by two well-known hotels, the Sealback and Embassy Suites. LMPD arrested 25-year-old Anthony Howard, accusing him of shooting the two people inside the CVS and endangering others. According to court documents, the shooter was targeting his former significant other showing up at her job while she was working. WHS 11's Isaiah Kim Martinez takes us to the scene of the crime a day later. Before sunrise, crews clean up glass from a broken door along the 4th Street CVS, shattered by gunfire. Then hours later, part of one of the entrance doors is boarded up. Ambassadors from the Louisville Downtown Partnership hold down fort in front, letting folks know at the time the store remained closed. To the CVS at 340 West Muhammad Ali on the shooting. Tuesday night, investigators lined the entrance. The manager possibly shot, trying to get further information. The caller ran into hiding. A young man named Anthony Howard is charged with attempted murder, assault, and wanton endangerment. Before this, he didn't have a criminal history, just one traffic citation. According to the arrest citation, police say Howard said aloud, quote, you broke my heart inside the CVS before shooting a female employee multiple times, a bullet grazing another person inside. Thankfully, they're both expected to survive. Now, we talked to the mayor about this issue. He says this emphasizes ongoing problems the city is working to fix. Incidents like this are totally unacceptable. Mayor Craig Greenberg says he's concerned over what appears to be domestic violence, which experts have told us makes up 15% of the city's homicides. We have are really focused on preventing domestic violence, working with other related agencies, both within government, like the Jefferson County Attorney's Office, but also other social service organizations. Meanwhile, it's not lost on the mayor or anyone else that the city will be seeing more tourists this week for the NCAA tournament, putting safety and security top of mind. Does it bring any concerns as far as what that might shed a light on in Louisville as a whole? It's, it's always concerning, and that's why our administration's number one priority is focused on safety. We need more officers. We need more ambassadors on the street to help have extra sets of eyes and ears to work to prevent crime from happening before it does. Greenberg says the fix is needed extend beyond just this damage. In Louisville with photojournalist Jessica Farley, I'm Isaiah Kim Martinez, WHAS 11 on your side.